We are master in the book, taste of the land. We are eyes to smile from the cheek. Darling, I will be loving you till we're 17. Maybe my heart is still for less hard as what it dreams. I'm thinking about people for the love in mysterious ways. Maybe it's a touch of the hand. Me and for the love you every single day. I just want to tell you, yeah.
the garden of your destinies, and the unswerving goal of your highest and best aspirations. Together, give yourselves fully to the service of Christ. Carefully build your home on the solid rock, so it will not fall when the storms of life come. Lee, uh, join your right hands, please. Lee, as you stand here before God and this assembly, do you take Victoria as your wife? Do you dedicate yourself to her welfare and fulfillment? and her usefulness in the kingdom of God. Do you pledge to love her, honor her, and strengthen her in sickness and in health, in adversity or prosperity, and to be faithful and true so long as you both shall live? I do. Victoria, as you stand here before God in this assembly, do you take Lee as your husband? Do you dedicate yourself to his welfare and fulfillment and to his usefulness in the kingdom of God? Do you pledge to love him, honor him, and strengthen him in sickness and in health, in adversity or prosperity, and to be faithful and true so long as you both shall live? The wedding ring is a beautiful symbol of marriage. Gold is precious, like your love for one another. The purity of gold symbolizes the purity of Christ that must encircle your marriage. The unbroken circle symbolizes his strength to help you keep these solemn vows which are not to be broken. Lee, you will give Victoria the ring and repeat the following. Victoria, with this ring I pledge you my strength. With this ring I pledge you my strength. And my support. And my support. My love and my life. My love and my life. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Victoria, you will repeat the following. <coughs> Lee, with this ring, I pledge you my strength. With this ring, I pledge you my strength. And my support. My, support. my love and my life. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. <coughs> now I finish the five box. Both bride and groom write their vows, some kind words to one another, and they place them in the fight box, along with a bottle of wine. When comes their first fight, they'll open the box, and they will read their vows each to the other over a bottle of wine. And this will help mend the fight. And it will remind them of the love that they share and the beautiful memory of this very special day. Take his hands, palms up. Take, take his hands. 
so you can see the gift that they are to you. These are the hands of your best friend, young and strong and vibrant with love, holding yours on your wedding day, as he promises to love you all the days of his life. These are the hands that will passionately hold you and cherish you through the years. And with their touch, will comfort you like no other. These are the hands that will work alongside yours as you build your future together. These are the hands that will hold you whenever illness, and fear, or grief may find you. These are the hands that will give you strength when you need it. These are the hands that will tenderly hold your children. These are the hands that even when wrinkled and aged, will still be reaching for yours. Now hold your hands. Lee, these are the hands of your best friend. Young and strong and vibrant with love. Holding yours on your wedding day. As she promises to love you all the days of her life. These are the hands that will passionately hold you and cherish you through the years. And with their touch will comfort you like no other. These are the hands that will work alongside yours as you build your future together. These are the hands that will hold you whenever illness or fear or grief may find you. These are the hands that will give you strength when you need it. And these are the hands that will tenderly hold your children. These are the hands that even when wrinkled and aged will still be reaching for yours. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, you've witnessed these words of promise that they have just spoken. May your Holy Spirit deepen in the mind of this man and this woman the sense of the sacred and binding power of their vows. May your rich and abundant blessings be added generously to their marriage. Give your grace and guidance that they may loyally fulfill these vows they have taken. May they find in their home a warm and joy-filled sample of the happiness of your eternal home. May their marriage be a good and faithful testimony of your goodness and glory. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Because you have made these sacred vows to one another, by the authority of God and the laws of this state, I declare that Lee and Victoria are now husband and wife. You are no longer two independent persons, but one. You may kiss the bride. together, let no one separate. Friends, I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Lee Park. Thank you. 
Thank you. 